Hello everyone, Sleep on the Wind here, now bringing you part 13 of my Grand Columbia playthrough. Grand Columbia is looking very grand indeed, um, and we uh, have Columbia Asia, which is just Southeast Asia here, which is pretty awesome. And then there's the puppet of the Colombian Turkestan. We, we all remember when that happened, after the Second World War in 1920, um, and the Russian Empire was dismantled. Uh, we all remember how that happened. Oh, look at that. The Russia's, uh, Russia's already a presidential dictatorship. That's awesome. All right, so we got Ukraine in on this. All right, so let's see here. What is Ukraine even trying to do? Ooh, prestige. Excellent. I don't even care what this is. You're going to make iron. That would be awesome. What is Ukraine even hoping to get out of this? Let's see here. Nothing anymore, apparently. They're just trying to survive. What are they up against? Belarus, France, Russia, and Austria-Hungary. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't know if they're going to survive that, but we'll see. I am sucking up a lot of infamy, and yeah, we're going to see what we get here. Operation Destruction Doctrine, okay. I am very tempted at this point to... Outrageous! Um, release puppets and declare war on Chin in order to create puppets in Asia here. Yeah, prevent them from doing that, please. Artillery support, thank you. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That's culture. Um, NCO training, please. Thank you. I'm very tempted to do that. We got enough time. I think we can do it. We could get enough out of this. So if we went through... Okay, so if we released... Um, Manchuria or Gundung... Here. And then declared war to free their cores from Qin. The Qin Empire. Because that would create Port Arthur, and that would create here. Holy God, that's a lot of fish. And here, which is selling silk. And then Port Arthur, which is just wood. But then, what's here? These two regions here. The question is, would they be released as civilized nations? Is there any way for me to tell that? I don't think there is. Alright, what are you? You're partially westernized. Alright, here's what we're going to do. We are going to... Okay, so we're going to release Port Arthur. I'm just going to experiment with this. Release Port Arthur. He is a civilized nation. Good. So he's Manchuria as a civilization. Okay. So, military access, please. Give military access, please. Alright, and... Undisturbed, I don't care. Alright, so he is now a civilized nation. We can then... Justify war. Oh, no, we can't? Oh. Well, shoot. Why can't I free... Oh, wait. Is he not my ally? I didn't make an ally out of him. Form an alliance. Okay. Oh, God. More research points. Yes. Huh. Even though he has allied cores, I can't... Oh, am I? Hang on. I might be... No more war. Okay, I got a little bit longer. That's that's what it is, probably. Alright, so we, re we release, release those guys.
shadowy cables in my Grand Columbia? Uh, yeah, go right ahead because that lowers your militancy. And let's get all these factories built. Oh, good. I released Manchuria and voting rights are rescinded. Well, guess what? We have a presidential dictatorship. Oh, God, I love the fact I took that guy. Wow, I'm fourth in prestige now. That's interesting. Let's get friendly with all these people. I can add Peru to my sphere, even though... Huh. Huh. Interesting. Increase opinion in Argentina, Uruguay, and oh look, Lithuania. Interesting. I already, I'm friendly with you, Lithuania. That's interesting, and the Crimea too. Huh. All right. So which one am I? You did. Okay. Alright, so we're putting another army down here. That's what's going to happen. Lose the mill and sea. We don't want that. That's bad. Bad, okay. Okay. In a war bombers. Nice. Alright. Oh, I really wish I could get my tech. Oh, iron? Yeah, switch that over to iron for sure. I would really love if you could build me an airplane factory. So many attack increases. Oh yeah, start researching that. <laughs> oh yeah, we'll attend that. We'll, we're all over that. Helmet mass production, cool. In fact, you, you don't sit there. I don't want all these combining really quick. Let's see if I can, I'm just gonna grab one of these guys. That's all you need. Oh, wait, no, you need a... Wait, what did I build? Four... Alright, well, I'm a moron. I built the wrong thing. Take that. Build me that. <laughs> build me an artillery piece, which is what you're supposed to build in the first place. Oh, I see. You got... You're stuck there. Come on, let's go. Actually, you're going to be the one. You go over here. Because this is going to take a chunk, a big chunk out of China and give me a okay powerful puppet. And, um... I'll take the mill and seat of the RDO. Um, this would be a, give me a fairly powerful puppet here in Asia at this point, which would be awesome. Police state, excellent. How are you doing? I really wish I could invest in you and do something with you. Because you really seem like a very poor and needy place that I really want to work on. Alright, so we got bankruptcy. Poor house. Doesn't really do anything. Ballots, well, oh, that's a whole bunch of Im immigration. We're doing that. How is our immigration right now? That's a good point. Let's take a look. Russia's fleeing, and Colombia's being loved by all for the moment. So is the United States and Mexico. 15 million people. Yeah, I probably should have pushed the liberal stuff here a little bit sooner, I think. All right, now, can I justify free allied cores? Beautiful. That's what I want to see. 
Let's go ahead and get started on that, because those are my ally cores. I want to release Manchuria. Actually, can I... I don't know if releasing a nation at that point is different. 4.5 infinite. That sucks. All pops become 3% more liberal. Okay. It's not the end of the world. It's a bonanza. Why aren't you building... Oh, we don't have any airplanes. Did I tell you to stock? I did. Are you building me something that builds me airplanes? Because that would be super. You are. NCO training tactics. Excellent. Beautiful. Everyone has railroads, right? Am I allowed to invest in you? I am. Alright, here's a question. What are you actually producing? Wood? Alright. Let's build you a sawmill. Just for the fun of it. I want to see what it does. If it'll even let me. I don't think it will. Explosive factory, go ahead. Alright, do we have... We have things over here. me in the U.S. doing? Okay. We're doing all right. Flying Circus Doctrine. Cool. Paramilitary groups and support. Excellent. Great war experience, please. Or... Modern Division Structures. That would be great. More liberal. Yeah, I'll take more liberals, I guess. That'll be okay. It's not the end of the world. What am I missing here? You're an engineer. Did I tell you to build another one? Or did that build... Oh, uh, that built up there. Okay. Oh, hang on. You, you finished building that. You can't build anything yet. And then we'll go pick up our uh, one random soldier up there. One regiment up in my port cities. Partially westernized. I have a feeling I'm just going to mow these guys down. Let's see. Field training. See, this is where I wish, if I told it to free an ally core, I wish the infamy would go to my ally at that point. Like, I'm I'm declaring war on your behalf. You should be sucking this up. Kind of thing. But I, I understand. I do completely understand why it is the way it is. Alright. Declare war, free ally core. He has three of them? Wait a minute, what? All right, region map mode. Let's see this. Quinn Feng Tung. Oh! That includes Peking. Huh! I... Huh. I didn't know he had that. All right, well, we'll do... Hmm... It's like 5 million people in there. It's also China's former capital. And I just noticed there's freaking coal here. Alright. Declare war. Okay. 
I call everyone in. U.S. will not accept. Italy will accept. Okay. We're just going to go on my own. We're going to manually call in people. Call Mexico. Call the FRCA in. I'll make sure to give them war subsidies. And let's see here. Do you touch? You do touch. There is no way I am letting you come in on this. You're just going to get stomped. All right, let's see what we got. 26 versus 4, and I have gas. Oh, Quinn, or Chin, or whatever your name is, you're going to have a bad time. I mean, they're going to take my port cities, but I don't care. Oh, that's not even the same... Wait a minute. Okay, hang on. Something with an H. Nope, that is that. Huh! It's going to cost me five infinity, though, for that. I do that. Otherwise, I'll have to wait five years. Then we can declare war again and try to get the whole thing out. I think... Let's see here. I mean, that gives them a population of a few mil. But this just makes them ungodly powerful. I mean, that's like... That's almost 5 million people right there. Give it to them. Must not come to violence. And that's just going to make Manchuria just super powerful. There's going to be 5 million people with their own cores there. As a civilized nation. Yeah, they're going to be behind, but they're going to be able to do something. So unless Japan wants to go to war with me at that point. I doubt... I doubt Japan's going to do that. Question is, uh, hey Mexico, you doing anything? FRCA is. Let's go, people. Dead people. Oh, okay. That, okay, that did not give them this. That only gave them this. Which is fine, because now that's producing iron. 
Hope you like railroads. Okay, that's too bad. I will... Whatever. Alright, increase relations with the United States now. Us are BFFs now. Excellent. Oh, excellent. These uh, laptops I'm working on is finished. Go ahead. All right, so I have Manchuria here as my puppet. Glass production, cool. All right, let's see here. Four million people and some prestige. We're building stuff in there. Oh, how's the uh, building of foreign investment? They built it. I think I'm going to have to go through these and start fixing some factories. Get great war experience. 27? Okay. Um, with this being the case, you, you are producing an ungodly amount of iron, which I'm so happy to see. You are producing iron and you are producing coal. You are building a steel mill then. And you are building a steel mill then. Oh, it's a colonial state? It has this core though. How is it a colonial state and has this core? That's weird. Airplane defense. All right, let's pull. Um, why was I not putting points into you? Alright, let's get the U.S. out of Argentina. I really don't care about Ukraine. I really wish I could do something to you. Let's get capital, please. Yeah, we're still socialists, that's good. Wow, we are... We are in the money. Taxes down a little bit. All right, cool. All right, our Grand Columbia is quite grand. Go ahead and expand forts. Now that's your capital, right? Yes, it is. Port Arthur is his capital. Cool. Immigration attraction plus 30%. Holy God. Do it. I didn't realize those went up that high. Um, with that, that's awesome.
Nope, maybe not. Yep, gonna have to leave it at that. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so now the question is, if I release Gun Dung, what happens? Literate NCOs, please. Cool. So let's take a look at that. Gun Dung 2... I'm up in the air on this. It's like, I mean, it's four million people in just this island, but that's four million people I'm taxing. Port Arthur was nothing, and then it gave me an option to take, uh, start pushing Manchuria out. With their are already building their armies up. I should have released Heng Jong, or whatever this is. Helen Jung? Helen Jung? Whatever. Consciousness, we'll take that for sure. Ukraine's no longer in her empire, I don't care, but you know what we are going to do? Increase opinion, we're never going to get around to puppeting these guys, so we're just going to start sphering them. Peru's the only one I'll leave out, because maybe I'll do something with them. But we've now speared all of South, Amer South America. Great war experience, perfect. Let's get all the military techs taken care of. Crisis in Central Hungary. Let's see here. Hungary acquires all scores from Austria. Freak, let's do it. Uh oh. That is all three of us versus the United Kingdom. And you are my good, proper ally, and you are allied with Newfoundland. And Canada is about to become a great power. Wait a minute, what? <laughs> Canada is a great power. Canada became a great power. It, their puppet... It, okay. We found the wind slightly confused by this statement. Like, everything in that statement about Canada becoming a great power, sure, why not? Um, let's see here. Faux solution, they will not accept. Oh, whoops, I backed Austria. I wasn't even paying attention. Oh, oh shoot. I wanted to free him. Oh, dang it. Okay, hang on. Oh well, whatever, we'll... Shoot. Oh, Czechoslovakia became a thing. Okay. Curious. I would lose 132 prestige. Ugh. If we go to war, I want my core out of you. You understand? I want my core, I want... I want my core and I want FRCA's core. So Germany, Italy, and the Netherlands are probably all gonna go for this. 
process. That's fine. Light piece. We got prestige out of that. Which is too bad. Uh, that is time, though. Um, so, Austria stays the same. That's not what I wanted. I want a hungry release, but I wasn't paying attention and clicked on the wrong one. So that will happen. That's okay. Uh, Congress of Poland and Germany and Columbia Near East. <laughs> God, I love this thing. <laughs> I wish you weren't primitive, though, but you are, so that sucks. And I have Manchuria as a puppet, which is building a fairly decent-sized army as a civilized nation. Oh my god, I love this. The Fantastic. 1930 comes around, we're freeing their core and probably going for Gundungs, too. Uh, we should probably release Gundung here pretty soon. You know what? Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. Let's release Gundung. As a proper puppet. Military access, please. Start pulling points into them. They have a... They actually have a, a freaking military. Let's get these guys over here and then we'll take care of this. That did lose me some money, but I am okay with that. Give you military access. And... Haiti better pay their debts. And then form an alliance with you. That cost me... Oh, I just realized that cost me a lot of people. <laughs> oh, I love it. Alright, but... You are... Are you, wait, I didn't even see, you are civilized, you are a republic, that is cool, and you are a presidential dictatorship, but we'll deal with you, um, that's fine. Okay, so railroads are getting done here, that's good. Um, how is, yeah, build all that, build a glass factory, expand all this. Alright everyone. We will call it here for part 13. I'll see you guys again for part 14. We're going to try and get all Manchuria stuff and then get Gundung their stuff. We do not have enough infamy for that, so we'll see what happens here. Maybe we just force the Quinn Empire to dismantle their nation or something. That would be kind of awesome. Um, and I really wish I could do something with this guy, but he's primitive and he won't let me invest in him, which is super unfortunate. Um, but I really wish I could do something. So, I will see everyone for part 14 here, uh, which will probably be the final part here, the way it's looking. We only have eight more, well, seven more years left. Um, so I will see everyone for part 14. Later.